For your college football picks, this is action here for Thursday, September 22nd. Tony T here with our college football pick show here for Thursday's action. Well, we have both games. Before we get into just a couple of things, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Free college football picks are updated all season long. Free picks every day from all the major sports. We also have NFL. We have Major League Baseball and more. It's a good time to subscribe. And also, if you would support our channel, hit the thumbs up. We greatly appreciate it. Then visit TonySpeaks.com or multi-capper site showcasing our top cappers in our industry. Click the link to the hot cappers to get signed up. Cappers like Mindy, who's been on fire here. Uh, we've got uh, Nick, uh, Paul, who's been on fire. If you look at our, our Major League uh, and our NFL uh, cappers right now, we've got uh, Ramon, top unit producer in the NFL. we got Ben. Click the links to the handicapper pages and get signed up to long-term passes. You'll find our premium picks at the top of the page. Drop down menu for the free picks as you scroll down. You will see uh, our premium picks offered by our cappers. Our best bet as well is in here. As you can uh, see there, each capper can designate one best bet per sport per day. Uh, so you can get there and get signed up with it. Also, each capper can designate one of their premium picks as a $15 premium pick just to uh, pretty much introduce you to their service. And as you notice, many of the cappers will make their best bet, uh, uh, their $15 pick a best bet. So check that out if you would. Our pick ticker, if you'd like to buy the picks individually, a certain game you're looking for, those are for sale right here, right here under the pick ticker upcoming games feature. Uh, also, our promo code, you can save 20% off all premium pick packages. When you use the promo code TONYT at checkout, you can access our page by clicking the link in the description and then the All Cappers tab to get signed up. And also, we'd love to hear from you guys, so post your picks in the comments below. All right, let's get this one started. West Virginia and Virginia Tech college football pick. This is on Thursday. West Virginia moves to 1-2 after their 65-7 home win to FCS. Towson behind 624 yards. You know, the losses came by 7 at Pittsburgh in a 55-42 home overtime defeat here to an improved uh, Kansas team. Uh, the offense has moved the football. Georgia uh, transfer JT Daniels completing 64% of his passes for 7.2 yards per pass attempt. Mountaineers are running for 5.6 per attempt. They have averaged 452 yards in their games against FBS opponents. The Virginia Tech, they improved to 2-1 after a 27-7 home win to FCS Wofford behind 475 yards. Hokies have a three-point loss at Old Dominion. They beat Boston College at home. Now in their FBS games, the Hokies averaged just 314 yards. Marshall transfer quarterback Grant Wells was unimpressive in his, F, uh, in his FBS games, averaging just 5.5 yards for pass attempt and four interceptions. Starting a running back, Malahi Thomas, doubtful for this uh, for Virginia Tech with an ankle injury. Just respect the Mountaineers' ability to move that football on Pittsburgh in their lone road game uh, uh, of the season, which they did cover, by the way. Mountaineers are holding teams at 3.4 yards per rush, and Wells has been a disappointment thus far under center for the Hokies. Prefer JT Daniels here. The play here will be West Virginia minus two. Coastal Carolina versus Georgia State. College a football pick. This one goes off here on Thursday, Coastal Carolina 3-0 on the season with their 38-26 home win to Buffalo, tallying 504 yards. Now, their other FBS win came at home uh, to Army by 10, and they gained 439 yards in that one. Quarterback Grayson McCall had a great 2021 season under center. This year, he's completing 70% of his passes, 9 touchdowns a pick, and 10.3 yards for pass attempt. He's also, uh, can run, he can also run the football as well. Now, Georgia State, they fell to 0-3 after a really bad 42-41 home defeat to a down Charlotte team. But they had the quarterback Reynolds come back, their senior quarterback. Now, the Panthers moved the football for 602 yards in defeat. But Georgia State struggled to defend the pass, giving up 401 yards passing to Reynolds with 43 attempts, 5 touchdown passes. Panthers quarterback Darren Granger, after a bad outing at South Carolina, showed improvement in his games against North Carolina and Charlotte. No, but these are two poor pass defenses and two quarterbacks that can put up big numbers. The play here, Coastal Carolina and Georgia State, over 61 and a half. Hey, that was our college football pick show for today. Make sure to like, subscribe. We're back here with more videos later today. We've got our soccer show. we got game day picks, drive-through. A lot coming on here on Tony's Picks, so stay tuned later for today for some more free pick shows.